Bitcoin is a breakthrough technology. In an era of relentless innovation, it emerges as an exceptional leap forward, tearing down barriers that have long confined our society's most vital institutions for centuries. Its impact is beginning to resonate through sectors, revolutionizing a plethora of interconnected domains. It finds paths through problems that were previously thought to have no solution, problems that we thought we must simply live with as a part of life. But this is the very nature of what breakthroughs do. They create a tremendous runway for all kinds of progress, not just in the fields they directly affect, but in almost everything that touches those fields. In the early days of a breakthrough, it is often hard to understand it, predict its outcomes, or even recognize that it is a breakthrough at all. Yet, a breakthrough's inexorable momentum eventually transforms civilizations. Take the mass-produced automobile pioneered by Henry Ford, for instance. In its inception, few could foresee the displacement of horses and the subsequent metamorphosis of entire cities and ways of life. Nations that failed to adopt the automobile fell far behind those that did. As cars became more abundant and advanced, criticism of their dangers and threats did not discourage their use. In fact, it only led to adaptations that made them safer, cleaner, more reliable, and ultimately more widely adopted. There was no stopping this thing once it got started, and not getting on board meant being left behind in a world transformed by this breakthrough. Living without clean, fast, affordable and accessible travel seems unimaginably primitive to us. But a life with horses as the main transportation source did not seem primitive to those who lived in the era where that was the case. An era that lasted thousands of years. Similar to the transformative power of the automobile, Bitcoin's breakthrough potential is gradually being unveiled. First, and quite obviously, Bitcoin is a breakthrough in what money is. Bitcoin is engineered money. Just as the automobile was an engineered form of personal transportation, replacing both the horse and steam-powered locomotives, Bitcoin stands to replace all forms of money it renders primitive. Bitcoin's leap in money is so significant that it often elicits disbelief, similar to the initial skepticism surrounding the horseless carriage or automobile. In fact, Bitcoin can be seen as a governmentless money, a concept that can be even harder for many to fathom. Welcome to Bit Intelligence. We produce documentaries that delve into the profound impact of Bitcoin on our modern world. Our films are grounded in some of the most impactful books, articles, and in-depth interviews coming from the Bitcoin space. Our aim is to educate a wider audience about the ever-growing impact of this remarkable technology. Follow us on this journey, and bit by bit, film by film, you will gain an incredible insight into the past, present, and future of money, government, economics, and human civilization. I have directed Secretary Connolly to suspend temporarily the convertibility of the dollar into gold or other reserve assets. The complete takeover of fiat money by the government in 1971 transformed the very nature of our governing bodies. It led government to rely on unlimited spending through deficits that would never be repaid. These practices set forth many negative consequences like inflation, a widening wealth gap, and a general decline in money's honesty and integrity. Bitcoin's potential to revolutionize governments is perhaps its most profound and lasting impact. Fiat money has reshaped governments, but not for the better. Today's politics often revolves around money, with politicians wielding significant power over industries and finances. It is safe to say that money in fact took over the government. So Bitcoin is then not just a breakthrough in money, it is a breakthrough in government itself. This may not be immediately obvious, but when one thinks about the link between money and government, one quickly realizes that a revolution in money must mean some kind of revolution in government, since the two are inextricably linked today. With Bitcoin, politicians will be evaluated based on competence in essential duties rather than grand promises. Bitcoin stands in stark contrast to fiat. Its supply is fixed and verifiable, 
and its distributed ledger is only amended through an extensive energy expenditure, not political favor. This characteristic challenges the belief that governments can and should dictate money's nature and distribution. It has become a talking point in political campaigns, indicative of its growing influence. Just as Henry Ford's Model T's impact on transportation took time to unfold, Bitcoin's transformation is slowly but surely divorcing the relationship between money and government and reinstating their healthy, distinct roles. Bitcoin's relationship with energy is equally as transformative. Similar to the automobile's role in triggering an industrial revolution, Bitcoin may catalyze a shift in the development of new energy infrastructure. Historically, every previous energy breakthrough has spurred a significant leap forward in civilization's growth. Horses demanded hay, which was grown through extensive agriculture operations. Automobiles ran on oil, which facilitated the transition of our society's use of coal and steam engines to gasoline and natural gas used in internal combustion engines. This marked a turning point in our civilization's relationship with energy, skyrocketing life expectancy, population and wealth. Yet today, this momentum is waning. Life expectancy and real GDP per person has plateaued as the petrodollar regime faces challenges in light of increasing global C02 levels and a rapidly changing environment. Eco-friendly movements work to disrupt carbon-emitting forms of energy, but with the foundation of fiat money being intricately linked to petroleum production in the Middle East, governments have no real incentive to create any sort of lasting change to our energy infrastructure. Could Bitcoin be the breakthrough in our relationship with energy that leads us to a more sustainable future? Early signs indicate it could reshape energy economics. Before Bitcoin mining, the broad infrastructure for generating electricity was to build out two types of generating facilities. The first, baseload power, uses technologies that generate a steady amount of power. These are technologies such as hydroelectric and nuclear. They are often referred to as base loads because they provide the minimum load of electricity that is constantly demanded. But electricity demand isn't flat. It changes during different parts of the day, during different days of the week and over the seasons. So in addition to base load power, we need sources of electricity that can be variably turned up and down to meet peak demand. These are technologies like gas and coal. There are also solar and wind. These both have the drawback that they are neither reliable base loads nor reliable peak loads because the sun doesn't always shine and the wind doesn't always blow at the same time that energy demand peaks. Using these latter two sources often creates unpredictable spikes leading to stranded energy or shortfalls in energy production. It must be consumed as it is generated. If too little is produced, we have brownouts. If too much is produced, we get transformer explosions and fires. Mining offers a solution. By stabilizing energy demand, it incentivizes baseload facilities to generate an excess of energy surpassing minimum loads while using mining to balance the load and consume what would otherwise be stranded energy. This benefits clean, emission-free baseload technologies like hydro and nuclear compared to emissions-heavy peak load plants. Furthermore, Bitcoin's elastic demand allows for the safe integration of wind and solar without worrying about grid overload concerns. This positive loop encourages cleaner energy sources, potentially reshaping the energy landscape. Bitcoin's transformative potential lies in untangling fossil fuel reliance for peak power, allowing a cleaner, more sustainable energy mix. In essence, just as Bitcoin challenges conventional currency, it has the power to challenge energy norms, fostering a greener, more efficient energy future. Bitcoin's impact doesn't stop at revolutionizing money. It's poised to disrupt the very heart of finance. The insidious consequence of fiat money is the widespread financialization of almost everything. Consider your aspirations. 
owning a home, securing a college degree or launching a business. What do they have in common? They all demand financing. This pervasive trend has embedded finance into the very fabric of our pursuits. But let's pause and reflect on this. Is this intertwining of finance truly essential? Should the pursuit of shelter, education or entrepreneurship be entangled with complex financial mechanisms? This web of financialization is a byproduct of fiat money's conjured existence, a system where financiers mint money to match their profit pursuits. Under this regime, financialization becomes a subtle form of inflation, artificially pumping money into various sectors and then inventing a need for that money to access fundamental resources. Picture an alternative, a world where housing markets don't balloon into bubbles, where students aren't shackled by insurmountable debt, and where small businesses thrive on their merit, not on their access to financial backing. Bitcoin is the disruptor of this cycle. It denies the option of inflating the money supply to fuel financialization. Imagine a reality where financing isn't the prerequisite for progress, where the path to a home, education or entrepreneurship isn't fraught with financial intricacies. Bitcoin offers this potential, stripping away the enigmatic layers of finance and bringing us closer to a more straightforward, equitable financial landscape. Embracing Bitcoin isn't just adopting a new currency, it's embracing a profound shift in personal responsibility. Bitcoin demands that we become custodians of our own financial destiny, active participants in the very fabric of the monetary system. This transformative journey emboldens us to master the art of safeguarding and growing our wealth, an endeavor that molds us into more informed, discerning individuals. A pseudonymous Bitcoiner going by the name Gunner wrote, when people are forced to take responsibility for their own actions, the production of goods and services will have to focus on quality, beauty and durability. People saving in Bitcoin will simply refuse to give up their hard-earned time savings for junk. Using Bitcoin creates individuals who are guardians of value, constantly evaluating the worth of their investments in relationship to material things. This starkly contrasts with the era of consumerism, readily available money, easy loans and eroding purchasing power where impulsive spending is the norm. Bitcoin is a catalyst for conscientiousness. It compels us to deliberate over every transaction to ensure that our efforts translate into lasting value. This metamorphosis doesn't just redefine our financial choices, it refines our character. The choice is clear between a future where our economic choices are governed by impulsiveness or one where each transaction is a deliberate step towards enduring prosperity. Bitcoin isn't just a currency, it's a gateway to a more considered intentional way of life. We stand on the cusp of a remarkable dawn, a dawn that promises to illuminate the future in ways we can scarcely imagine. The contours of this transformation are yet to be precisely etched shaped by the collective ingenuity of humanity as we harness the power of this breakthrough. Recall the seismic impact of the automobile, a breakthrough that propelled us into an era of unprecedented change. Similarly, we can anticipate that the ripples of transformation unfurling from Bitcoin will be no less profound. The march of history is about to pen another chapter, and while the exact strokes remain hidden, the grandeur of the narrative is unmistakable. It carries the promise of reshaping our world, forging pathways to untold possibilities. So let us not clutch onto outdated certainties, but instead, let our spirits soar with the eagles of change. Thanks for making it until the end. We are Bit Intelligence. If you enjoyed this documentary, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to be notified about more documentaries every month.